Hello students, hope you are doing well. What is a good score and rank in JEE main exam? This is one of the most bothering questions for most of the aspirants as students are often confused about the score or rank that must be secured to get admission to NITs, triple ITs or to be eligible for JEE advanced. Securing admission in NITs or qualifying for JEE advanced might not be a difficult task with a good preparation strategy. In order to clear your doubt on what is a good score or rank that a candidate must score in J main exam. The term J main good score varies from person to person. If you are aiming for admission in NITs or triple ITs, the good score may be different and the same may vary for a student who aspires to get admission in IITs. The analysis for the same can be checked from the following video. So what is a good percentile in J main? Based on our analysis for the previous cutoff for J main, we have prepared this table according to which a very good percentile for J main is somewhere around 99 to 100. A good percentile ranges in between 90 to 98 percentile. An average percentile ranges in between 70 to 89 percentile and anything below 60 can be considered as a low percentile score. Now let us look at what is a good percentile to be eligible for J advance. Precisely a good J main score is something that will make you eligible to appear for the J advance exam. A good score in J main can be around 250 plus. According to the previous year's trends, the good J main percentile or score required to appear for J advance was quite high. Hence, it is quite clear that the candidates need to score at least 200 to 210 marks from general category in J main to be eligible for J advanced exam. Now, what is a good percentile to be eligible for NIT admission? In order to secure admission in NITs through J main, the good score for the same can be around 85 to 95 percentile. At the same time, the candidates must feature among the top 15,000 to 20,000 rank range to get admission in the top NITs. According to previous year trends, candidates who featured in 1 to 20,000 ranks made it to top NITs across the country. However, some NITs also closed ranks around 2 lakhs, mostly newer NITs. Now, what is a good percentile to be eligible for triple IT admission? In order to secure admission in triple ITs through J main, the good score for the same can be around 85 to 90 percentile. At the same time, the candidates must feature among the top 25,000 rank range to get admission to popular triple ITs. According to previous trends, candidates with 1 to 25,000 rank range made it to top triple ITs. However, candidates securing ranks beyond 25,000 to 1 lakh also made it to triple ITs that included newer IITs or regional level triple ITs. Now, what is a good percentile to be eligible for admission into top institutes around India? In order to secure admission to top engineering colleges in India apart from IITs, NITs or triple ITs, you should have above 80 percentile in JE main exam. There is also an option to appear for entrance exams conducted by various deemed universities. That's all for today. Thank you. We hope that the above analysis helped you to have a complete idea of a good score or rank in J main. You can also fill the common application form on the provided link for direct admission to BTEC courses in top private engineering colleges across the country. For more updates on J main cutoff and admissions, stay tuned to College Deco. If you like this video, do like, share, comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel.